Talmud Bavli, Gemara Brachot, Perik Shishi, Chapter 6, Daf Membet, page 42a. I'm just going to start from the last couple of words on the previous page. Page Sha'ani Yain, wine is different. The Gorem Bracha Latzmofra brings about a blessing for itself. Rav Huna Achal Tleisa Rifte B'nei Tal Tlata Tlata B'Kaba Rav Huna ate 13 breads, kitchen breads, of which there were three to a kav, below Barich, and he did not recite the Birkin Muslim blessing afterwards. Amalei Rav Nachman Rav Nachman said to him, Adei Kafna, these were for, uh, to satisfy hunger. Ela Kol Shacharim Kovim Alav Sealda Tzarech Levarech Rather, whatever, um, Whatever it is that others establish for a meal, that is for what that is what one must recite. Um, that is when one must recite a blessing. That is a blessing for bread. Rafun Rav Yehuda Havai Asik Le Livre Be Rav Yehuda Bar Chaviva. Rav Yehuda was arranging uh, his son to the daughter of Rav Yehuda Bar Chaviva, meaning arranging marriage. I to look at my Yehu Pat Haba Abichnis Bichisnin, they brought before them bread that comes with Kitnin. Ki Atta, when he came, when Rav Yehuda came, Shama Sham Inu Dakam Barche Hamatsi, he heard they were reciting the Hamatsi blessing on it. Amalehu, he said to them, My Titi Daka Shamana, what is this Titi that I am hearing? Dilma Hamotzi Lechem in Haaretz Kameva Chitvu. Is it possible that you are reciting the blessing of Hamotzi Lechem in Haaretz? Amrele, they said to him, Ain, yes. Detanya for his daughter Nabraisa. Rabbi Mona Ama Mishum Rabbi Yehuda. Rabbi Mona reported in the name of Rabbi Yehuda. Pat Haba Abi Chisnin, bread that comes with Kitsnin, Mevachina Leha Hamotzi. We are reciting at the blessing of Hamotzi. Lama Shmuel and Shmuel said, and Shmuel said, Halacha ka Rabbi Mona, the Halacha called to Rabbi Mona. Amalehu, Rabbi Yehuda said to them, Ein Halacha ka Rabbi Mona itmar, uh, meaning your, uh, the Halacha does not accord with Rabbi Mona, is what was said, meaning you're mistaken. Amrele, they said to Rabbi Yehuda, Vahama, Vahama, Hudama Mishme Mitishmuel, but Master is the one who said in the name of Shmuel, Lachmaniot me'arvin bahen. We may make an error with Lachmaniot. Umevachin alehin hamotzi, and we recite on them the blessing of hamotzi. Shani hatam dekava sildate alehu, alayehu. It is different there, for uh, one established his meal around the Lachmaniot. Aval hecha de lo kava sildate alehu, but where one does not establish his meal around them, lo, no, you don't. Rav Papa Ikla Levi Rav Huna Bere de Rav Natan Rav Papa visited the home of Rav Huna the son of Rav Natan. Matar Dagamar Seudatayehu after they finished their meal. Aitehu la Kamayehu midi la Mecha they brought before them something to eat. Shakal Rav Papa Vaka Achil Rav Papa took, uh, took food and was eating. Amri Le they said to Rav Papa. Lasavar Lamar does master not hold Gamar Asumil Echol one finishes the meal uh, once one finishes the meal it is forbidden to eat. Amalehu Rav said to the Rav Papa said back to them Silekitmar um, one removed uh, only when one removed uh, is how it was stated a meaning once the bread is removed from the table um, that's when it is forbidden to eat. Rava Rabbi Zera Ikla Ikla Ulave Resh Galuta Rava and Rav Zera visited the home of Resh Galuta Lavata de Saliku Taka Mikamayehu after the servants removed the table from before them Shadulehu Ristanami Be Resh Galuta they sent them a portion from the home of Resh Galuta Rava Achil Rava ate the Rabbi Zera Lo Achil but Rabbi Zera did not eat. Amar le Rabbi Zera said to Rava Lo Savar Lamar Sileka Sumele holds as master not hold. 
um, that once it's removed, it is forbidden to eat. Amalei Rav, Rav said to Rav Zera, Anan ataka de Reish Galuta samchinam. We are dependent on the table of Reish Galuta. Uh, meaning we are his guest, and in this situation, the removal of the food does not constitute an end to the meal. Amar Rav, Rav said, Haragil b'shemen shemen ma'akvo. One is accustomed uh, with oil, meaning you uh, put oil on your hands after eating. Shemen uh, ma'akvo, the oil holds him back, meaning uh, meaning that because there was no oil, uh, he's not considered to have ended the meal. Amar Ravashi, Ravashi said, Ki havinan be Rav Kahana, when we were at the academy of Rav Kahana, Amalan, he said to us, Kegon anandirigilinan bimishra, bimishra mishra ma'akvalan, like us who are accustomed with oil, oil holds us back. Beleit hilchata kechol hanei shamatata, but the halacha is not in accordance with any of these teachings, Ela ki hada'ama rabbi chia bar ashi ama rav, but rather with that which rabbi chia bar ashi said in the name of rav, shalosh tchifot hain, there are three immediacies. Techef le lismicha shchita, immediately following the leaning, uh, is it slaughter? Meaning, uh, once you leaned on the offering, then it had to be, uh, had to be slaughtered. Techef lig ula tfila, immediately following the redemption, um, is, uh, is prayer. Meaning, once we say the, uh, bracha for, uh, for redemption, um, goel gael Israel, we say shemun esra straight away. Techef leniti latia daim bracha, and immediately following the washing of the hands, um, is is the um, Birkaramazon, is the blessing for Birkaramazon. That would be at the end of the meal. Amar Abaye said, Af Anu Nomar, we too can say, Techef letel midei chachamim bracha, immediately following Torah scholars is blessing. Shinemar, Vivacheni Hashem Biglalecha, as it is stated in Hashem, bless me on account of you. Ibaite Mahacha, or if you wish, from here, Vivarech Hashem et Beit Hamitri Biglal Yosef. Shnema, for it stated, sorry, for it stated, and Hashem blessed the Egyptian's house on account of Joseph. Um, the point being made about immediately following Torah scholars is blessing is one who befriends a, uh, a Torah scholar and invites him into his home brings immediate blessing into his home as well. If one recited a blessing of the wine that is before the meal, he is discharged uh, the wine that is after the meal. Berach al hapar peret shilifne amazon. If one recited a blessing on the peripheral dish, that is before the meal, hatar et hapar peret shalachar amazon. He has discharged the peripheral dish that is eaten after the meal. Berach al hapat. If one recited a blessing on bread, hatar et hapar peret. He has discharged for the peripheral dish, al hapar peret, um, on the peripheral dish, lo patar et hapat. He is not discharged for the bread. Beit Shammai, or Marine Beit Shammai says, Ah, Lomase Kedera, not even, um, not even porridge, meaning, uh, meaning he doesn't discharge uh, his obligation for porridge. Hayu uh, Yoshvin, they were sitting together, Kol Echad Mevarech and uh, all of them, each one of them recites the blessing for himself. Hesev, Hesbu, Hesebu, they reclined, um, but if they reclined together um, to eat, Echad Mevarech Lechulan, and one can recite for all of them. So, if you're sitting, you 
but not reclining. But if you're sitting together, then each one says for himself. But if you're reclining, then one can recite for all of them. I'm just going to go to the next page. Um, next page. Balahem yain betach hamazon. One is brought to them during the meal. Kol echad ve'echad mevrechad smo. Each one recites the blessing for himself. Achar hamazon. After the meal, echad mevrechad cholam. One recites the blessing for all of them. Behu omer al hamugmar. And he says uh, on the incense. Ve'af. That is the blessing on the incense. Ve'af al pi she'en mevi'in et hamugmar ela la'acha. Seuda, even though they do not bring out the incense until after the meal. Gemara. Amar Rabba Bar Bar Chana, Amar Rabbi Yochanan, Rabba Bar Bar Chana, said in the name of Rabbi Yochanan, Lo Shano Elam Be Shabbatot Be Amim Tovim Day Tor, only with regard to Shabbat and festivals. For Iru Va Adam Kovea Seudator Al Hayain, since a person established his meal around the wine. Aval bisha yemot yashana, but during the rest of the year, mivarech al kol kos vekos. One must recite a blessing on each and every cup of wine that he drinks. Itmanam, he was also stated, Amar Rabba Barbar, Rabba Bar Mari, Amar Rabbi Yosho ben Levi. Rabba Bar Mari said in the name of Yosho ben Levi. Lo shano ela b'shabbatot v'yamim tovim. They taught only with regard to Shabbat and festivals. Uh, that is, they taught that the blessing on pre-dinner wine covers post-dinner wine as well. Uvishah shadam yotzei mi beit hamerachat uvishah uvishat hakazat dam. And with regard to a time that a person leaves the bathhouse, and with regard to the time of bloodletting, or ilva dam kaver sodator al hayayim. Since a person establishes meal around the wine, aval bisha yomot hashana, but during the rest of the year, mevarechal kol kos vechos. One must recite a blessing on each and every cup of wine that he drinks. Rabbi Bar Mari ikla levei Rava bechov. Rabbi Bar Mari visited the home of Rava during the week. Chazyei devarech devarech lifnei hamazon. He saw that Rava recited a blessing. Before the meal, the hata barich la charamazon, and he again recited a blessing after the meal that is on the wine being served. Amale Rav Bar Mari said to him, Yishar, well done. Vechen Amar Rav Yosho ben Levi, and so did Rav Yosho ben Levi say, um, say that uh, that's appropriate. Rav Yitzchak Bar Yosef Yikla Levei Habaye Bayom Tov. Rav Yitzchak Bar Yosef is the home of Habayam and festival. Chazia Tvarech. Tvarich akal kasa v'chasa. He saw that Abayi recited a blessing on each and every cup. Um, Amalei Rav Yitzchak Bar Yosef said to him, Lo savar la mar laha de Rabbi Yosho ben Levi. Does master not hold that which Rabbi Yosho ben Levi said? Amalei Abayi said to him, Nim lachana, I'm one, I'm one who has reconsidered uh, and he decided to drink more wine. So this is about the wine that he drank after the meal. Ibai Lahur, they inquired, Balahem Yain Betoch Amazon, wine that was brought to them during the meal. Scroll down. What is the law, whether it discharges the wine that is after the meal? In Tomtsei Lamar, if you should say, Berach al hayayin shalifnei hamazon poteret hayayin shalachar hamazon, if one recited a blessing on the wine that is before the meal, he has discharged the wine that is after the meal. Mishum deze lishtot veze lishtot, because this uh, is for the purpose of drinking, and this is for the purpose of drinking. Aval hacha deze lishtot veze lishtot, but here where this, this wine, is for the purpose of drinking, and whereas this one is to wet, meaning it helps the food being swallowed. Lo, no, 
or Dilma Loshna, or perhaps there is no difference. Ravama Potya Rav just charges the mid the, the mid dinner wine. Sorry, Rav says um, uh, that it discharges that the mid dinner wine discharges uh, a blessing obligation for the post dinner wine. Where Rav Kahana Amar Eino Potya, but Rav Kahana says it does not discharge for the after dinner wine. Rav Nachman Amar Potya, Rav Nachman says it discharges. Where Rav Sheshet Amar Eino Potya, but Rav Sheshet says it does not discharge. Rav Huna ve Rav Yehuda ve Chol Talmidei de Rav Amrei Eino Potter Rav Huna and Rav Yehuda and all the students of Rav say it does not discharge Eitive Rav le Rav Nachman Rav Rav challenge Rav Nachman Ve Rav Sheshet Amar Eino Potter Rav Sheshet says it does not discharge Rav Huna Rav Yehuda v'chol tamidei de Rav Amrei e'no poter Rav Huna and Rav Yehuda and all the students of Rav say it does not discharge. Ei tive Rav Allah Rav Nachman Rav Hachalat Rav Nachman lahem yayim betoch amazon kol echad ve'echad mevrech that's what wine is brought to them during the meal each one recites the blessing for himself. Lachar amazon echad mevrech lechulam after the meal one recites the blessing for all of them. Amarei he said to Rabbi, "This is what the, uh, this is what it is saying. Hachi uh, kamar. This is what it is saying. Meaning the missionary is saying, 'Im lo ba lahem yain betoch hamazon ela lachar hamazon echad mevarech lekulam. If one was not brought to them during the meal, but only after the meal, one recites the blessing for all of them. Berach al hapat patar et hapar peret al hapar peret al hapatar et hapat beit shamai omrim af lo mase kedera. Um, so." One recited a blessing on the bread, uh, he has discharged for the peripheral dish. Uh, but on the peripheral dish, he has not discharged uh, for the bread. And Beit Shammai says that not even for porridge uh, is he discharged of the blessing. And that's a quote from the, from the Mishnah. Ibai Lehu, they inquired, Beit Shammai, Aresha, Plige, are Beit Shammai disagreeing with the first? Or Dilma Asefa Plige, or perhaps they're disagreeing with the latter. De Kama Tana Kama Berach Al Hapat Patar Et Hapar Peret. That which the Tana Kama says, uh, one recited a blessing on the bread, he has discharged the proof for the peripheral dish. The whole Shekane Mase Kadera, and certainly the blessing on the bread, um, covers porridge. The Ate Beit Shamay Lamema, but Shamay comes to say, or disagrees by saying, Lo mi baya par peret de lo patra lehu pat. Needless to say, needless to say, the peripheral dish, peripheral dish, uh, that the um, does not um, discharge for for the bread. Ela filu mase kadera nami lo patara, but even for porridge. Uh, bread will not discharge either. Or Dilma are safe for plige, perhaps. Beit uh, Shammai are disagreeing with the latter. To katane berach al parhar parperet lopatarat apat. That the Mishnah states, one recited a blessing on a peripheral dish, he is not discharged for the bread. Patu de lopatar aval maase kadera pata. It is only bread that the peripheral dish does not discharge, but it does discharge for porridge. The atul Beit Shammai Lameymar. And Beit Shammai comes to disagree. Beit Shammai says, Vafilumase Kadere Nami Lopatar. It does not even discharge for porridge. Take all. So let the question stand. <coughs> They were sitting each one. Hesebo ein, they reclined. Uh, yes. Lo hesebo, hesebo lo. If they didn't recline, no. Uminehu, but contrast this with Asarashe hayo ochim batera. Ten were travelling on the road. Ach al pishe kolam ochumi ikakar echad. Even though they were all eating from a single loaf. Each one must recite the blessing for himself. Yashu lechol they sat down to eat. Ah, al pisha kol echad ve'echad ochel mikakaro. Even though each one is eating from his own loaf, echad mevarech lo kolam. 
wondrous acts of blessing for all. Katana Yashu Ath Al Pishwa has saved all of the gross estates that they set, even though they did not recline. Ama Rav Nachman Bar Yitzhak, Rav Nachman Bar Yitzhak said, Kegon de Amre Nezil Venechu Lachma Beduch Kalan. A case in which they said, let us go and eat bread in such and such a place. He Nach Nafshe de Rav, when Rav died, as well Tommy Dabatre, his students followed him, meaning they followed his coffin to his, to the gravesite. He Hadre, when they returned, Amre Nezil Venehu Lachma Anhar Danak, they said, let us go and eat bread on the Danak River. Bata de Harke Yatve Vekami Baya Lehu, after they had eaten, they sat and inquired. Hesebu Davka Tanan Aval Yashvalo, does the mission state that they recline specifically? But if they sat, um, doesn't doesn't one recite the blessing for all? Oh, Dilma Kevan de Amre Nezil Venehu, Rifta Bedukta Planita. Well, perhaps once. Once they say, let us go and eat bread in such and such a place, ki hespu dame, it is as if they reclined. Lo hava bi dayehu, they did not have uh, an, an answer at hand. Kam rav ada bar ahava, uh, at that point rav ada bar ahava rose to his feet.